Hey, Storm Nation. I'm Steve Klemkin. We're here with Matt McNeil. Matt, thanks for joining us. Hey, Steve. Always a pleasure. There's been a lot of buzz about the fever pitch. This ball just came out. In fact, it was just announced just very recently uh, to the bowling world when Jesper Svensson actually threw this ball on the TV show down in Arlington, Texas, the Hall of Fame Classic they had down there. And we had tons of questions in the phone, you know, ringing off the hook and emails coming in asking, what's that ball? What's the cover stock? What's the core? What is it? What is it? So we published that information, but I tell you what, Jesper didn't just stop there in Texas. He is crushing them this week in Oklahoma. There's two tournaments they're running in one. There's the Oklahoma Open, as well as the Roth Home and Doubles Classic. They're running these two tournaments together. And Jesper averaged, I think it was almost 260 his first round. Every shot last week in Texas was with the fever pitch. Every shot this week in Oklahoma is also with the fever pitch. So we wanted to get you out here on the lanes too and throw it as well. You know, you're not a two-hander, Matt. You throw it with your thumb in the ball. You don't have 600 RPMs. In my day, Matt would be considered a high rev player, but we were just talking too. The rev rate has gone up so dramatically now in the bowling world that now a player like yourself, you know, with a 350 to 400 rev rate is considered kind of sort of medium normal, kind of average. So we want to see what the fever pitch does in your hand. So let's get Matt on the lanes and let's throw some shots. All right, Matt, well, I tell you what, I liked what I saw. I think you were smiling, so it looked like you liked what you saw too, but why don't you tell us in your own words what you saw out there? It, it was really impressive. Uh, generally, moderate rev rate and urethane aren't two things that intermix very much, uh, especially at higher levels of competition. Um, I was just really impressed about how easily this ball got down the lane, and then it transitioned all the carry down. I'd been bowling on this lane for the last two days here at Storm HQ, and we didn't rerun them. It's a beat up 41. 41 foot pattern. So to be able to take this ball out of the box and see the amount of shape I was getting down lane with it uh, was really, really eye opening. And it, ge it gives me a lot of comfort to know as a guy that, you know, when the lanes transition to a point where I get kind of stuck, I can't really go around it anymore and I can't get my ball to shape anymore, this ball is a huge get out of jail free card in the fact that I can square up back on it, which is a strength of mine. And I can use this ball to get down the lane. And I know even though there's a bunch of bowling that has been done, this ball is still going to make the corner and go through the pins. That's cool. Well, I tell you what, I mean, it's a new combination. It's a new cover stock on it. We call it power control pearl urethane. Uh, but it's not just a traditional urethane. It is amped up. And I think that's what you were mentioning you were seeing. You know, a lot of times when you talk about a urethane cover stock, you're talking about a ball that's going to read very early, transition, you know, really slowly. And by the time it gets down to the back of the pattern, you've got, you know, you've kind of used up most of its energy along the way. So you don't see much of a back end reaction, but that's not so with the fever pitch. I mean, we saw plenty of back end out there with yours. And the other thing that's really unique about this ball is when you look inside uh, underneath the cover stock, we're looking at a tour block weight block, which uh, is more similar in construction to the original High Road. The High Road has a thicker shell. The Fever Pitch has a thicker shell. There's not that lightweight material around the weight block that we call the core material. That doesn't exist in the Fever Pitch. So this is just a strict weight block technology. It's a brand new urethane pearl sanded cover stock. And I tell you what, the combination has just been fantastic. So. Uh, make sure you go out and check your uh, local Storm VIP Pro Shop and reserve yours today.